<laughs> and we're back. Um, so again, we're going to get into chapter nine next. And chapter nine is about operations with function. Operations with function. Um, within chapter nine, you're going to talk about adding, subtracting, um, operations with functions, multiplying and dividing with functions. Um, and, and you're going to get introduced to a brand new type of operation called composition of functions. So you're going to talk about add, subtract, multiply, divide, and composition of functions. The uh, the operation symbol is actually an open circle. Um, looks something like this. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Um, but it's it's pretty interesting that you get to learn a brand new operation. We've done a bunch of different operations in our lifetime. You know, add, subtract, multiply, divide, square root, to cube root, cube, square, whatever. Um, now we get to learn about a new operation called a composition. Um, now, to work through this chapter, because the next week is kind of weird, uh, because the timing and everything is kind of weird, um, I'm going to let you work at your own pace. I've got three videos up online. I've got guided notes for you guys to do. Um, I've got the assignments all here for you and, um, and the, uh, the, the answer keys I have ready for you. And then the, the big assignment is this, um, is this uh, scavenger hunt type thing. Yeah. So basically what you do is you start here with the start here card. You do this problem. You find that answer, wherever that answer is, G of F of, of zero, which you'll learn what that means. And you say, OK, maybe it's maybe it's negative three. Right. And then you find negative three and then you do that problem. And then you you solve that problem. And maybe it's three X squared plus 26. And then you do that problem and you, it keeps going and going and going. But there's 20 cards all over the room, so that's kind of a bigger assignment. Um, now, this this activity, this this week, you know, um, is three sections, and you can again work on them at your own pace. I've got guided notes for you guys to have, which I'll pass out in a second. I'm hole punching them because I forgot to hit the hole punch button on the copy. Oh, no. I know, I know. Now I've got a hole punch button. Um, I so let me talk you through the schedule. Let me talk you through the schedule of what I think you should be facing this as. Okay. So you're going to work Tuesday, that's today, through Monday of next week on this choice board. Feel free to work on any box at your own pace. You will staple the all you staple the worksheet and all book work together. And I'd like you to submit your guided notes. It says staple. Um, you're going to submit this all online. This was before I had people submitting stuff on Canvas. So you're just going to submit this on Canvas. But, but what I need to see is the worksheet for the scavenger hunt thing. I need to see the book work, which you see here. And I need to. I would like you to take images of your guided notes. Because usually when I have you guys watch videos, I have you watch videos and then nobody watches them and they just do the homework. Um, so I want to actually see you do the guided notes. I want you to I want to see your guided notes to make sure that you are actually doing what I'm asking you to do. OK, um, so I want to see guided notes, book work and the answer sheet for the scavenger hunt. That makes sense with all work on there as well. Um, so you see the three videos along the top. I'm going to show you where those are. If you just click on really any of the week's links there. Um, it takes you to this page. This gives you the choice board document, these links to the three videos right there, and then these scavenger hunt cards. It's funny, this is actually when I was in my old room. Um, so if I click on that, that actually, this is an image of my old room where I was at, but it gives you all these cards. So if you were looking at these things, if you wanted to work on this from home, um, I have all of the images there. Um, you're going to submit to this assignment. This is, um, has, you know, it's 45 points total. Why is it so much? Well, because this is basically three homework assignments, which is 30, um, plus this additional um, work for, and I'm giving you five points for um, uh, each guided notes to do. Okay, so I'm looking for five points for each guided notes, 10 points for each homework assignment, meaning the book work, the scavenger hunt, and the book work. Okay, um, I've got keys here for you. Once you show me what, once we, you show me that you've done the work, like you can just show me your paper, I'll hand you the key uh, for the book work. And uh, on Monday of next week, we're going to do a full in-class review. Um, 
it says I made a typo here. It says be prepared with questions that you have over the notes or, or any activity. This will take place on CrossFit Wednesday out right Monday. Okay. Forgot to change that right there. I've changed all the other dates in this thing yeah. except for that one. Which one? Well, I think I think the, in the full class review box, switch that it says take this will take place Wednesday, that will take place Monday of next week. Okay. Now, because Tuesday and Wednesday are late start days, um Honestly, within the 25 minutes that I see you guys, you could probably get this full assessment done. But we decided to just break it apart into two pieces anyway, just just for the sake of time. So you're going to take part one of the test on Tuesday and part two of the test on Wednesday, okay, of next week. But honestly, it's just a front and back of one page. So we just decided to make two separate copies um, and put a name blank on the second one, and then we'll just put it together. It's the same length as what I would always do. And honestly, again. You could probably get it done within 25 minutes, but I don't want to rush anybody. So, are there any questions? Are there any questions? Yes, sir. Are we able to use the calculator this time? Yes, you are able to use your calculator this time. I believe so. I don't think there's. Yeah. Um, are there any other questions? Okay, I'm going to shut off the video and I'll let you guys get working.